the book that I'm actually working on now, originally it was about healing from a divorce. Um, but in my process of healing from a divorce, I realized that I spent way too much of my life um, thinking about my I existed in relation to love and relationships in men. Mm-hmm. And yes. there's so much more to a woman's life. Um, and I wanted to talk about family and I wanted to talk about friendships and I wanted to talk about the highs and lows of professional endeavors. Cause you know, like everyone who considered successful, it's not a straight line, you know, it's, it's right. some ups and downs, some squiggles, some backtrack. Um, but I wanted to talk about all of those things. I wanted to talk about like a well-rounded life. So I'll get back to talking about love and relationships at some point, but I want to talk about the other things that make women whole and fulfilled and successful as well. I love that because, you know, that's my whole damn mantra, um, which I don't know. Um, I think it's going to be very interesting when this book comes out because there are so many people that are probably going to buy into it because they think it will be uh, probably along the same lines as your uh, your preview books. And it'll be interesting to see if they're willing to accept it because I got to tell you, there are so many women that are very much wedded to the patriarchy um, being upheld and and such as that a woman is less than if she's not married and does not have children. There are women that are committed to that as well. Of course, we already mm-hmm. know that the men are committed to that storyline, but there are a lot of women that are committed to it as well. Have you found that, you know, because I know that you have a huge online presence. Have you found that you're um, running, a, running up against women that um, kind of have that idea about well, yeah, you're saying that because you're divorced or saying that because you don't have kids or you're saying that because you're not married. You know what I mean? Um, I'm sure it comes up. My audience tends to be women who have well-rounded lives. Um, I'd say half of them are married, half of them are single. They like conversations about relationships and dating, but they like conversations about work and other life issues, travel, um, all sorts of things because they are well-rounded women. Um, no one's ever directly said that to my face about like, you know, these are things that you don't worry about because you don't have them. Um, I'm sure it happens. Um, I know that those types of women exist. Um, Mm -hmm. so, you know, I believe that if you, you have the right to decide what you value, if you want to place your value on, you know, my husband and my kids, like that is the number one and number two thing for me, then absolutely go for it. Who am I to tell you what you should value in life? But at the same token, who are you to tell me that that's all I should value? Um, I value other things, but it doesn't mean that I don't value a husband. It doesn't mean that I don't value children. It means I'm not currently married and I don't have kids. 